To other news now, small-scale chicken farmers are reeling from the effects of the ongoing shortage in baby chickens. Our news team in St. Elizabeth observed the lengths some persons have to go to get the birds. More in this report from Duane Anderson. There is a saying about the rewards of being an early bird. But these days, if you're a small-scale chicken farmer in St. Elizabeth, you're only rewarded with birds if you're very early. It is why some of these persons leave their homes from as early as 5 a.m. most days to line up at farm stores to try and get their order of baby chickens. I would like them to um, produce more chicken that small farmer can get it because even now we are here from 5 o'clock, some people are here from 6. I look out there, look to chicken, whether you raise it for your yard or you raise it for sale. But boy, I may tell you hard. But when you come here hard, you can't get none. But they have been chosen person with them again. Earlier this week, the operators of some farm stores in St. Elizabeth had to call in the police to restore order after some customers' frustration boiled over. Some refused to social distance, while others were just upset they can't get the chickens to buy. What I'm saying, um, if they um, receive like 2,000 chickens and people come to get 100, they could divide it and give somebody who can get 25, give everybody a little... They don't have no behavior. We don't act like an adult. We don't care how they say if um, you line up or whatever. Everybody has Because everybody wants Nobody something. Nobody now we have found their time. The farmers explained that the shortage of baby chickens has impacted the market in different ways. Meat short chicken, 200 a pound, some place 220. You can't get chicken to cook. You have to buy other meat and stuff. And I know everybody can go up to 200 and 220 a pound baby chicken. It's really chicken hard and rough. Rearing chickens has become a go-to business for many residents after sugar and bauxite took a downturn in St. Elizabeth. The Jamaica Agricultural Society had confirmed that baby chicks have been in short supply in parts of the island for several weeks. Dwayne Anderson, TVJ News.